the most clickbait Minecraft hacks of all time, and I'm going to be testing to see which ones are fact or tap. Rails in Minecraft use a lot of iron and wood. But if you place three minecarts on top of each other on a power rail, it won't need any more rails to move. What? What's even better is you can leave one block gaps. and the They float? What's this, Hogwarts? My body is not ready, but I really want it to work. Back them. Yeah. Only three, huh? Okay, one, two, three. Okay, before we break the blocks and see if it works with the gap, does it just work normally? Oh, wait, this is so cool. Uh, nah, dog. Bro, I've been building minecarts the wrong way the whole time. Okay, now we gotta see, does it work with the gap? Come on, gappy flappy. Dude, if this works, I'm so pumped. Show me the flying minecart in three, two, one. No way! <laughs> 10 out of 10, this is not cap. You can get invisible armor in Minecraft. Right now, what? I'm completely invisible. And all I'm wearing wait, is Wait, wait, wait. So you can make just the armor invisible on your body. Dude, to get this amazing armor, all you have to do is type this command. What is this? Attribute at S Minecraft. All right, whoever puts this first in the comments will pen it. 100 armor points. The same Thank as you. a full set of netherite what? armor. Except totally invisible. No way! So we've got the command loaded up in this command block. But first, I want to test it with just netherite armor on. How much damage do we take from a zombie? Uh, okay. <laughs> Basically nothing. We've been hit six times and we took half a heart of damage. Okay, now we're going to take all the netherite armor off. Okay, versus now we got no armor. Yeah, okay, so we take a full heart of damage with one hit now. But what about our new command? All right, add S. So it's armor and then it's base set 100. Okay, so the command's been set. Now we gotta add a little button. And boom, base value for attribute armor for entity team in our frag set to 100. And what? Half a heart? Wait, I'm taking damage though. It took six hits from the zombie to do half a heart of damage with the netherite armor. But now every two hits, we're taking half a heart. So it is working, but it's not as strong as the netherite armor. Can you go higher than 100? Can you go to 1,000? Yeah, okay, we did one to the power of 12. Oh, we still take damage. I mean, it works, but it's not as good as netherite. We can do half cap. <laughs> if you're ever underground with a pig and a saddle, you can actually use x-ray. If you walk wrong- Ah, dude, not another x-ray! We've already busted this once. Half stab on the ground, on the pig. You can see all the caves the in the area. No. Pretty helpful for me. How it, bro, my caves never look like this. I know it's fake before I test it. No, pig, come back here. But we got to test it for science. But dude, okay, but if you're not in creative mode, you're going to die. Bro. <gasps> no, this shouldn't work. Wait, but okay, but if you're in survival mode, aren't you just going <gasps> to... You can do it in survival mode. You don't take damage. This is freaking nuts. So to do x-ray, you just need a pig. I respect pigs so much more now. If you're ever completely surrounded by lava, <laughs> you have no fire resistance potion. If you place a bed and go to sleep, you'll be protected and won't get set on what? fire. But you'll be stuck there. But you'll be stuck there. So it's kind of useful. Bed's down. Uh, server, please fill this hole with lava. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Now, can we click into the bed? Nope. You can only sleep at night. Server, set it to night. Okay. <gasps> <laughs> you can click through the lava. All right, we're taking no doubt, oh, but as soon as daytime hits, you just die. So, like, is it even helpful? Like, I've got an idea. Like, what if, okay, server, teleport me to you. So, again, it's it's true, but I don't know when you're going to ever use this. Ever wondered what causes those creepy cave sounds to play? It's actually not random. Yes, I have, actually. It relies on this section of the- What? I've never noticed this. So, if the mood- Hit 60%? F3 screen called mood. That increases over time when you're underground and decreases what? when you're near light. When it gets to Wait, 100... this is like a sanity function in a game. I didn't know Minecraft had this. When it gets to 100%, a random cave sound will play. And it'll reset back to zero. Huh? What? When did they add this? Oh my god, dude, uh, this is... It's wrong. Oh my god, this is crazy. Look at my mood. Now, does it go up if I don't move? It does. So if you're just standing in a cave, your mood is going up. Now, if I walk, does it go up faster? No, okay, so it's the same no matter what. Once this hits 100%, though, is when we're supposed to hear a random cave sound. Oh, wait, it's going down. Is it because I found diamonds? <laughs> yeah, I wish. No, I think it's going down because of the light source. 0%. So if I go away, does it go back up? Oh, it's going back up? So we know it's not the diamonds. Now we know money can't be happiness. So the torches should work too then, right? Oh, it's going down, dude. Bro, this is wild. I've been playing Minecraft for over 10 years, and I had no idea that there was a mood. Okay, I wanted to go to 100%. I haven't heard it. I haven't heard a cave sound yet. Speaking of mood, I need to know: Are my new glasses a mood? No, these are not blue blockers. I have prescription glasses. I'm apparently blind without them, and I just found out after 29 years of living. So there's a new precedent town. 
and he's got glasses. Now, if you like them, comment the uh, glass emoji. You know the eyeglass emoji? This guy? Yeah, the handsome looking nerd. Oh, we're almost there. Hold on. 97%. Bro, I've been here for five minutes. So if this doesn't work, I'm going to be real triggered. Don't waste my time. It worked. That's freaking crazy. Look at it. It starts all the way back from 0%. This is fact. Giving a wolf maximum regeneration, health boost, and absorption effect okay. makes its tail spin in circles. This is because tail angles represent a wolf's health. So stacking all these effects makes the tail go crazy. <laughs> Bro, you know what? He turned into a helicopter? Oh, dude. Helicopter, helicopter. Okay, so we've got all the effect blocks over here. Try this out now. All right, come here, doggy. All right, we got to tame him first. Yeah, let me look at that tail. Okay, we're going to give him absorption to start. Tail. All right, we're not really, we're not really moving right now. Okay, how about this? We got absorption. Let me see that tail. Uh, nothing's happening. Okay, finally, regeneration. Let me see. Oh! Wait! <laughs> look at it go. It's like really slow. Oh, that's creepy. That is so weird, dude. <laughs> that is facto, ladies and gentlemen. If you want to turn your dog's tail into a helicopter, you can do it. You no know, golems in Minecraft will actively try to leave any confined space they are in. They check for- Oh yeah, they want to be free. Like Willy. Exits every few seconds and walk out. Too bad what? villagers aren't that smart. What? Snow golems have the biggest IQ? No way. All right, let's see how cooped up this guy is. So is he really brilliant or what, man? Shh, Mr. Snowman. All right, one by one. Now what happens when we open it? Oh, he turned. Now did he turn to face me? No, he wouldn't do He wanted to be free. And free? Oh, immediately. Okay, this honestly, this is not big enough. Server, please spawn in the maze. We need a better test. Oh, snow golem. <gasps> All right, well, death aside. Okay, I'm gonna block the exit of the maze. Now we spawn in the golem. Did he just look down? It's like he's telling me to open the maze. So as soon as we open this, does he know how to get out? <gasps> what? No. No. Wait, do I block it again? Does he get confused? No, he doesn't. He knows, dude. Bro, snow golems are the smartest thing in Minecraft. All right, this is, uh, this is bad, bro. This is fact. We free golem. <laughs> yeah. Bubble golems are one of the best ways to travel quickly upwards, but you can also create one of the deadliest traps with them. Oh. Just spam a bunch of harmony potions at the top of the bubble column. Hey, yo. And then block it off with obsidian. And whoever has to This guy's evil and brilliant. Wait, so you just put a bunch of them at the top? No way, dude. Okay, so we go up to the top, throw them down, and let them they just like float in here? Oh, dude, that's so freaking evil. Oh, they're like ender pearls. They don't splash until they make contact. Like, I'm telling you right now, if I sent a pig, look at this pig. Get in there, pig, get in there. So, pig, you gotta go. I'm 90% sure. <laughs> wait a second, I gotta see that again. Pig, wait for me. And. <laughs> Bro, this is the death elevator. And you know what's sick about this too? Is you get the XP. Ow, but you take damage. <laughs> That is fact, man. That's a way to auto farm and get the XP. You know that in 119, Mojang added four hidden paintings to micro. Now, see, this guy looks like uh, I believe him because he, he's such a like a distinguished looking gentleman. Four hidden paintings to micro Java edition. Four? But you can only Wait, get them four? via Whoa. commands or modding the game. Whoa. It's water, earth, fire, air. Wait, is this Avatar The Last Airbender reference? I've read command blocks to hopefully summon all four paintings if it works. I'm turning my back because actually, like, I haven't tested this yet. Oh, and. <gasps> Wait, that's so sick. Wait, this is honestly, I love these two. Like, I couldn't choose. Okay, this one is trash. Like, this one looks like, like Earthbenders. Y'all cool, but like, y'all, y'all like dirty. The air one's pretty sick too, but I don't like it a lot. It's kind of, it's too, it's too creamy for me. What? Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. This is fact. I thought it was going to be a cat. You can actually use enchanting tables as a way to catch intruders in your base. Anyone what? trying to snoop around and- <gasps> Wait. Steal your items is probably going to be invisible, but the enchanting table's magical power- Wait, that is brilliant. I've never thought of this. actually show you there's someone nearby by opening up and facing straight towards them. Grandma, Whoa. what are you doing? Why is this not in Bed Wars? Wait, this is perfect. So if you get within like, is it two? Oh, okay. So it only opens up if you're like three blocks away from it. Look, it's facing me. So from this distance, you're fine. But if you get within like three blocks, it starts following you. This is the power of knowledge, ladies and gentlemen. When they speak... What? Hello? Server? <laughs> Server, I know you're there. <laughs> Wow, <laughs> I'm just watching. Dude, that's so cool. 
What did they do? So they did a smithing table. <gasps> oh no, man. No, 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 no. You can't make chain armor like that. No, you can't. You, you can't. You can't make chain armor. It's just not craftable. Okay, that, the elytra's gone. Dude, okay. <laughs> Wait, what did we do? Wait, whoa, whoa, no, okay. What? Should, no, no, dude. There are so many things in this one I gotta test. Bro, I'm like 900% sure this is all fake. All right, you know, before we test this, comment factor cap, because like, I just, I know it's cap, dude. I'm starting with the chain armor. I freaking knew it. We, we knew it, but like we wanted to believe it. You know, like we wanted to believe this. Just like I wanted to believe I had perfect vision when I went to the doctor. I really want to believe the elytra on work too, but it's not. I, I, hold on, wait a second. At the very least, hold on, hold on. Because one thing he did have is he had the elytra and he had the chain mail. And he turned the elytra into a different variant. Uh, okay, now I got to add this. And then, yeah, dude. Like, dude, you can't even add it to the smithing table. Everything about this was freaking cap. Free in Minecraft is now non-bannable. If you play Java Edition, you may know that there are some secret key binds using F3. F3 no, and B turns on hitboxes. Yeah. F3 and G turns on chunk borders. Okay. And F3 and H turns on tooltips. But none of these are as overpowered as F3 and H. Just show us what you're doing. <laughs> these people are, he's letting me cook. A, which simply reloads the chunks around you. Yeah, we know so that. So how does that even help? And how is it powerful? Well, it doesn't reload entities. Meaning okay. that if you just spam F3 and A, you can see mobs through walls. But not just mobs. Minecarts, chests, what? spawner particles, and even other players can be seen no! through walls when you reload Wait, wait, take it. Whoa, whoa, hold on. Rewind. What the heck? Why toast sucker wearing a bikini? See, this is why X-Ray is too powerful. So it's literally built in pay to win to Minecraft. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, you can hear we've got a... <laughs> I've got a big box set up with, uh, we got minecart and a chest and a zombie inside this giant box. And he just said, all you gotta do is click F3A. Now let's see, F3A. Um, <laughs> dog, I don't think this works. Does it work from the top? Nope. Bro, this is garbage. This is not work. Hey, yo. <laughs> Server, what are you doing in here? Just, 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 just hiding, just checking out. Server, this does not even work. Like, I can kind of see. Nah, dude, this is, this is like, this is straight up cap. You're welcome. I saved you. No free x-ray hacks. Stop looking. In 1.19.2, there was a glitch that allowed you to completely bypass full damage. If you what? jump from 35 blocks or higher and hit crouch at exactly the right time, you'd be able to walk away like nothing happened. Ow. What? Wait, I, that's all we got? All right, well, now we got to go to version 1.19.2. Oh, dog, dude. This is hard. Oh, shoot. Come on, come on. Oh, no damage. Wait, so you have to perfectly time this. It does work, but it's really hard to do. Plus, it's part of an older version, so it's fact, but it's old. <laughs> this is a pyramid is a structure that, of course, generates in jungle biomes. Yeah. So many of us know the jungle temple contains two chests. Yes. One chest is on the bottom floor while avoiding the arrows, while the other chest okay. is found on the top floor when you reveal it with the lever combination. But did you guys also know there is another secret chest found within the temple? <laughs> Dude, this is killing me. That's right. If you break Wait, there's the a third chest stairs within the temple, it reveals a hole for you to drop no, into. No, it does Once not, you fall man. Into the room, you'll be no, it doesn't. People try to build these fake secret rooms inside of these natural spawning the places. Chest. And there you go. Enjoy the extra diamond. D yeah, it bruh. We know it's fake. Dude, okay, so first chest. Crack the code. We already cracked it. Okay, boom. Oh, smithing templates. I actually didn't even know that these came in here. So that's the first chest you get from the levers. Then once you go past the arrow trap, you get this chest, bamboo. But then now he's saying you go back to the stairs, break these, and there's gonna be a magical... <laughs> Where's the magical place under here, huh? These are always fake. Yeah, every freaking time. You guys have got to stop it. Did you know in Minecraft that if you go into spectator mode and left click like on a painting, you can actually see a Minecraft world through the eyes of that... What? Why? The painting's an entity? Wait, but okay, so if you go into spectator mode, you can't go into the wooden block. That's freaking crazy. Like, I'm inside the painting right now. 
Oh no. Are the paintings watching us? Dude, this is like a, like a genuinely terrifying myth. Because if you can go inside of the paintings in spectator mode, that means they're entities, which means they would be technically living. Like you can go into a sheep because it's alive. What if the paintings are alive and have been watching us every single moment we've been playing this game for the past 10 years? Okay, this one's fact and I'm scared that it is. This Most guy's on half a heart. Know that you can milk the rare mushroom with a bowl for unlimited mushroom stew. Yeah, okay. And most people know about suspicious stew. What most people don't realize is that you can get suspicious stew by feeding your mushroom what? a flower. What flower? Each suspicious stew correlates with a different type of flower. Wait, no. You can get different stews? So using this, you can gain easy access wait, to the Wait, 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 dude. Okay, like low key. Freaking, hold on. Go rewind. Take a screenshot of this if you're on your phone or tablet. The different type of flower. So using this, you can gain easy How would you figure this out? Food. This makes the cows so much more useful. I am sorry, cows. You must become brown cows. Thank you. Oh, don't die, though. <laughs> Only the strongest will survive, they say. All right, well, at least we have one cow left. All right, like, without looking at the cheat sheet. Can you tell me which one was night vision? All right, and I, I'm gonna pretend like you guys just said it was Lily of the Valley, so thank you, because I think that's the one it was. Hey, look, if it's strength, it's not a big deal, right? Like, poison? Really? Huh? Now, I want to blame you guys for this, but I feel like it's my memory that got me into this. Wait, but it worked. So Lily of the Valley, I would never feed that. Okay, Lily of the Valley is bad. What about Allium? Dog, so this supposed to give me fire resistance for 30 seconds. No freaking way, dude. Give me the corn? Corn flour? Get the jump boost? Dude, this is, wait, this is cool, man. Bro, okay, even though they don't last long, this is fat and it's freaking amazing. No way. This would be sick, but there's no shot. I feel like I would have known this by now though, right? Like if this works, I, okay, buddy, I'm gonna give you, <laughs> welcome to the barber shop. <gasps> no, but he's alive. Can you put it back on him? You can't? Bro, I just gave this guy the worst fate of his life. I'm so sorry. Save this part in the video right now for Christmas 2024. That's all I'm saying. Nobody knows. Okay, not the Mr. Beast song. Nobody knows this. When I see that, I just think it's fake right away. I, I don't know why. Okay, so we make a, make a, what is this, like a portal? No, what the? Okay, okay, dude. Dude. You're making it look too, like what? This is so many steps. Wait, wait, did you just see that? Go back, rewind. Did you just? Not cool. Not cool, man. That hits, that hits deep. <laughs> oh, man. Like, it's just, there's so many steps, too. Friggin' boom, boom, boom. Just boom, boom, boom. Put the little portal outline down. I want to see fill this with lava. Like, what's the point of this? But he does it, and we gotta follow it. Then he covers it all up with slime blocks and then decides to place this in the center. Do you know how many dragon heads you need to do this? Like, is it even... That's so dumb. Okay, and then, now listen, listen. Before you waterlog it... Hold on, we're missing an item. We're missing... Splash Potion of Healing. Splash it. Waterlog it. You can't even waterlog the portal! <laughs> I freaking hate these people. When you don't have enough space in your inventory, you can use a crafting slot to hold blocks. What? If you turn on touchscreen mode and controls, you can what? put items in these slots. Your device doesn't even need to be touched. What? No. You get four free spots? Wait, dog, that's crazy. Because there's 36... What the... Fr <laughs> Chase's pickle? Okay, this is... <laughs> I'm sick of Chase messing with my Minecraft. Anyways, there are 36 slots in your inventory. This would mean that you would get a perfect 40 if this works. How do I get even, I don't even know where the touch screen mode is. What, mouse setting? Uh, oh, oh, oh. Okay, it's in mouse settings, touch screen mode on. And you're telling me that I can just, what? What? No. Oh, but it goes away. Okay, so they go in there, <gasps> but they go back in. Wait, so does this not work? Hold on, should I throw them out in the ground first? Oh, hold on. And it <laughs> doesn't work. But I thought this was actually such a big brain thing. This is cap, but I will tell you something that actually expands your inventory space for free. Give yourself a bundle. This little bad boy right here, you can actually put stuff inside of it. It only has two spots, but that's better than no spots. And speaking of two spots, which spot will you click? Left or right? You gotta make a choice. Make one so that I have to keep standing here doing the T-pose, please. <laughs> okay, thank you. <laughs> oh! <laughs> 